Hello and welcome. Today we're going to check out Mask of Semblance. This is an action RPG focusing on, quote, stylish combat, cinematic storytelling, and moral decision making by Red Essence Games. It's over on itch.io right now. This is actually a demo, free to play, uh, still in pretty early development. But I thought we should check it out. Uh, it's actually been in development for quite some time, but uh, this is a new demo that came out re reasonably uh, not so long ago. So anyway, let's see what it's all about. We're going to do one player. There is a two player option, even on the demo here. We get a bit of a story here explaining what all is going on with, uh, with the story. I've been struggling to remember where this started. I was there. And now you are here. A cascade of images, as though it were a dream. And what would it matter anyway? I awoke as though it had already begun. And there I was. As clear as day. As though it had always been. As though it might always be. So here we find ourselves again. And one might think it's such a pity. To be chained unto the other. And to think one could be found. To be chasing the sound. Chasing the sound. Chasing the sound. Listen to the sound. And weep. Weep for all that you've lost. All right. So let's figure Something out what's going on right. here. What's that now, boy? Do you remember how we got here? Or why we're here, for that matter? Well, it's hard to say why we're here, boy, naturally. No, 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 you're not listening. Why we're here, in this forest, no. No, 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 this is all wrong. Okay, so uh, yeah, ignore the controls up there. This is this is designed for uh, Xbox One controllers, so they haven't worked out the keyboard and mouse controls, which is what I'm using today. Boy, and you can see we're what's wrong? we're having a day. Ah, my head. Ah, that sound. <sighs> Let's kill well, some things. We'll have to address that later, won't we? For now, steal yourself, boy. It appears we have company. Left mouse click. Just go off on you guys. So I got that little guy floating around with me. He can do some things too. We can use him to shoot. Like that. He's like a little... Ooh, I don't know what he is. I'm guessing we'll figure that out in time. But, uh... can also pick these red things up, which are going to give me health. Not that we need any. We're full health, though. Now we get some angry plants going to shoot at us too. Here's telling me to shoot some fireballs. There we go. We'll do that. Smack that uh, angry plant. Take that. I'm, I'm very yelly. I'm, I'm having a day. I, mentioned, I didn't mention that before. We have some dancing monkeys around here. We don't like monkeys. We murder monkeys. Just like that. Well, we can try to get them anyway. He's throwing snot balls at me. Come now, boy. You can do this. Kill the monkeys. I have leveled up. Uh, it doesn't, I don't really do anything with that. We can see in my menu here. My XP, yeah. All that stuff is over there. What we do. Controls over this way. We can do various things. You can see I detach old Boone. Boone is my uh, my buddy here. We still have For now, let's kill things. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Don't stand in the things. Stop chewing on me. Get away. There we go. Those all shoot out very not kindly in, uh, in diagonals. So we're going to not hit. I hit, not get hit by him. There we go. Did I get you yet? Oh, lay bombs. Right, right. So you can, like, lay bombs down. Which, I'm not mastered yet. But we lay flowers out and then they go boom. I'm going to talk to this flower over here. Hello, flower. Thank you, flower. Man. Bad day. It's making me feel so heavy. I need to find a place to rest. And quickly. Well, you'd best hurry on then, dear boy. Okay. Move on. Very, yeah, very good. The art style is very cool. Uh, here's where we can pause and we can view all our stats and all that. But, uh, no, we'll continue on. Let's find ourselves a place to rest. And here it is. Uh, 
What's even the point? I'm useless to them. So this town's having an even worse day than me. Hmm? Hello. Boy, don't you think you should introduce us? Oh, yes. Yes, sorry. Um, pardon our intrusion. Your door was the only one open. A boy, a talking mask, and an Okanai. How queer. There's nothing here for you, child. You must leave. Um. Oh, respect. Leave to where? Look, with all due respect, leave to where? This forest is clearly cursed and. Uh, there's that sound. Respect? You have much to learn of respect, child. But yes, I know this sound of which you speak. It is problematic. Problematic would be one word for it, I suppose, yes. <laughs> Indeed. Indeed it would. Well, do you know anything about what's going on here? I take it you've been here for a while? I do not know much of what ails this forest, child. But what I do know, I shall tell you. Sit. Rest a while. Close your eyes and listen. Story time. Interesting story time. Oh, interesting way of Polani telling it. Of the Palat Crafters Guild. We are of the Pylon. So this curse of the Palat. We Pylon are nomadic people, mostly keeping to our self contained groups, wandering from place to place and living through the gifts of the soil. This is our quest for this demo. We bring with us the seeds to grow our homes. The sacred tapper. They bear us fruit and shelter, as well as light in its absence. I'm moving this, by the way. Usually, this would suffice. Okay, we'll go this way. As you can tell, these woods are anything but usual. Sometimes, if you listen closely, you can hear the whisperings of profane and awful things. But to most, it manifests as nothing more and nothing less than an exhausting dissonance. And it is because of this, where once we were crafters and tradesmen, we are left as husks. Obsessive. Detached. Empty. And without a trace, Palmuchu, our researcher, Gone. I have never truly known the emotion that you might name as fear until I came to hear the whispering of this forest. The Tapa and its inhabitants can only survive as long as the soil will nurture them, and they are not long for this world. And with them too shall we meet the soil. Palani, I'm so sorry. That's awful. Your sympathy is appreciated, child. It's been a long time since I've heard any words of kindness. Every waking moment I have maintained a meditation to ward away these evils. I have fought, I have resisted, and I have held on to hope. But the voice of the forest, it holds me so sweetly. I fail to see how we have time for this boy. No, I want to help. Palani, I want to help you. I could never ask such a thing of you, child. But as much as it wounds my honor, I'm in no position to be turning down such help. Do you mind if we take a look around the rest of the village, Palani? Feel free. Just don't expect the other Palati to be of any help. Oh, and on that subject, Perhaps it would be worth checking Palmulchu's tapper first. Mm hmm. Duly noted. Luck, find your feet, wanderers. Okay, let's go explore our village here. We already saw that guy. He doesn't seem to want to be any help. No, it's wrong. It needs to be perfect. Why isn't it perfect? Stop! Stop! You're scaring her! Mm 
Ah, uh, this must be Palmuchu's Tapa. Hey, Palmuchu, where are you? Been here for weeks, and the sound has been growing louder by day by day, stressing in a way that's utterly beyond words, beyond comprehension. Although sometimes when I lay my head down to rest, the din subsides into a whisper, and one can almost make out words. I dare not repeat them here. Awful words, cryptic words, words of malice and deceit. If one were to heed them, one would surely be emptied and driven into madness. I must seek out the source of these whispers and silence them. I may, f I fear I may not return, and if I do not... Palani, you are the soil beneath my feet. I did this for you. I couldn't bear to see your light fade beneath these whispers. I'm sorry. I love you with all of me. Tapa Imak. Let's not tell Palani about this just yet. As you wish. Okay, got a letter? Ah, it seems Palmuchu has a secret. Palmuchu's got mm -hmm. a secret guy. I suppose we should go and see what's ahead then. Destroy blue jamas with your blade. Cook your oh! Wait, what part for doing? Oh, I, I see. I see. Hey, get out! What's <laughs> with the size? All right, let's figure out what the uh, Pomochu has been doing. There's no like, there's no volume settings here, so it's either it's all or nothing on volume. So I apologize if it's a little weird. Ah, indeed, but it's happening again. We need to be quick about this. Agreed. There's no use to anybody dead, so let's get this done. The music is a bit loud, but I want to make sure the voice volume is plenty loud. Uh, all right, let's go over here and uh, see what we can figure out. So I think this is going to be, a, yeah, puzzle at time, right? Uh, we're going to go, I guess, this way. Oh, yeah. Okay, that was easy. Yeah, stop with the humming. I'm sorry, boy. Will you try there we to go. Think? Logic puzzle time? Yeah, it certainly is. Uh, <laughs> okay. I don't really know. Um, I guess we're going to have to go the other way. Like this one first. This one. No? Oh, it must be. Okay. the button. We can do this in a certain order, aren't we? I don't quite understand what it's telling me. Clearly something is here. Um, oh, is it telling me to do like this? Or is it telling me to do only this side and then this side? Oh, yeah, okay. I see. I get it. And that was the reset I was hitting. I get it. Just read the instructions. It makes things a little bit easier, doesn't it? I'll take some health. Oh, one of those trees. Yeah, there we go. Oh yeah, we filled it up. Okay, so good. How are you feeling, boy? So now ah, we can move on to. Are you doing that? What? You think me a sadist, boy? Ah, well, you're not making a very strong case for yourself. <laughs> Shoot it. Okay. Now we gotta get this one, the Z. All right, here we go. Detach and move freely. We go move around here. We can. Um, we can go through this maze right here. Actually, I did this one before when I was doing a bit of a test game, so I, I know what this one is. I didn't do the logic ones before. Okay. 
Shoot that one, light things up, and move on. Isometric maze time is what this is all about. And uh, we'll shoot that. It's hard to get him to shoot right away. We got timer on this one, so we're gonna go and shoot it. And run. Okay. Catch again. Maze time. Let's see. Go uh, that way. This way. it for uh, Frizzy. Yeah, there it is. Okay. Now we've got a couple more. How are you feeling way. now, boy? Oh, terrible. Uh, just spare me, please. Let's go to this one here. <laughs> boy, it wasn't even me in the first place. Come now. You can Gosh. do this. Ah. ah! I know. Don't worry. And thank you. What, what is going on? I wonder what the numbers on these panels mean. Good well, question. There's only one way to find out, isn't that boy? Let's be on your toes. A lot of twos. So are you paying attention to these? That's just barrels over there. Let's go. Oh, I think I'm going to be sick. Calm down. Oh, that's how long they go until they do their thing. Um, I don't know where I'm going here. This isn't where I want to go. Okay. Interesting. Is a word, I guess, a word to use for that. <laughs> okay, we got one more to go. Let's go do it. Oh, this architecture is just exquisite. Don't yeah, it's all right. Honestly, I can't say it's high on my list of priorities right now. What do we have? Let's, what's left? Grit. All right. Oh, is it boss killing time? <laughs> Something killing time. Oh, those monkey guys are back. monkeys. Here we go. This is, uh, I guess, our last one. I don't know what willpower is used button. We can do, there is a, you know what, actually, there is a thing I can probably do. Ouch. If I hit X, it's supposed to be some sort of special thing. But I don't know what that is. If I hit X, it doesn't do anything. I don't know. Um, drop some bombs too. Ouch. Um, there. Ooh, well, is it gonna work? Yeah, it did work. Hey, hey there we go. All four trials completed. Do you still hear the sound? Mm-hmm. But it's quieter now. I can actually hear myself think. Good. Let's get this finished. Okay. 
Let's move on. How do you think the Pilati are doing? I'm sure they'll be just fine, boy. Stay focused. We must be nearly done here. Sorry, I'm not saying much. There's interesting thing happening. Pilati, gather round. Welcome back, my kin. I have missed you all so dearly. I know you're all wondering what has happened, and there will be time for such talk soon. But for now, you must know this. Two wanderers came upon our village, a queer sort, a boy, and a mask. The likes of which I have never seen, glowing and talking as though it were man. And though I know it wounds our pride, my friends, I believe it is to them whom our lives are owed. And if we see them again, we must honour them as kin. Now come, we must finish repairing the bridge quickly and make preparations to leave. Our tapper will not last long. Tapa a mac. Tapa a mac. Ouch! Oh, I'm supposed to be moving. Uh, hey, go away. What's we doing here? Oh, here we go. Is that Pomuchu? <sighs> Evidently. What have you got against these people? I have nothing against them, boy. We merely have more pressing matters at hand. Ouch! Need some health. No, 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 no. Uh, how am I supposed to lose this thing? Here we go. Here we go. Exit. Hope it went the right way. Okay. It seemed to damage me when I'm standing at the thing and, and doing it. You would sooner do nothing. And for what? Boy, from the young. Oh, you speak in riddles and tongues. I beg you, start making sense. Oh, I've told you before, boy. Time and time again, in fact. But you weren't ready Ouch. to listen. Who are you? What if we go here when? and go like this? When have you ever told me anything? In fact, I don't even know why I listen to you. You're always getting us into these... These absurd situations! Was it not you who walked us in here, boy? <sighs> yes. Uh, maybe he could still be saved. I don't know. I'm just trying to help! Are you, boy? Are you? Forgive me for thinking otherwise. Why okay, we gotta go doing back to the other side, I guess. Me? It was you who didn't want to help! It's not all about you, boy! Then what is it about? Pilati. It's about Pilati. And the rest of them. I... Precisely, boy. Now be silent. And finish what you came here to do. Oh, where did, I, where did I open up? Not this one? Oh, here we go. This way. Shooting his hand. I'm not quite sure what we're shooting here. 
Are we supposed to hit that? Oh, that way. Okay. Very screamy. Voice acting is actually really good, though. <laughs> okay, come on down. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Right on me. There you go. Come on. Can't seem to hit it. Oh, we have to hit that, and then it goes down? Yeah. Now almost. So hit him in the uh, whatever this is. Armpit. I wish. Go over there now, I guess. Um, get that way? No. How do we get over there? Ouch! Um, how do we get over there? Ouch! I'm gonna die here. Uh, I need some healing. Healing plants. Um. Oh, here we go. Yeah. Charges, right? Yeah, it does. Okay. As it pops back out, we're gonna blast it again. That was so close. One more. the right direction is, is, a, is a problem. Wow, it hurts! There any, uh, there's no healing out here, is there? Mm. Can we shoot those? Oh, look at that! We can shoot them! Oh, well, that makes things a little different. Ooh. About to die. said enough for today. With one hit point. <laughs> Wanderers, you return. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, yes. I could have quite happily spent days there admiring the architecture. Oh, it was simply marvelous. So it was you, Wanderers. I could sense you were both strong of character. Uh, do excuse the dear boy, Balani. I have a feeling that he's a little tired. Hmm. Very well. Did you? Did you happen upon Palmuchu? Um. Do we give him the relic? Yeah. This, this is this is the moral dilemma, isn't it? Um. We will give her the relic. Well, we found what's left of him. Whatever the relic was. I will assure that he is returned to the soil. I'm so sorry, Palani. Don't be, child. We must all return to the soil eventually. It is merely a question of when. What would happen if we didn't give her that? So we give her the letter, or not give her the letter? Oh, we'll give her the letter. Also, we found this letter in his tapa. I think you need to read this. Oh dear, Palmuchu. You foolish man. I wish there were more we could do. 
Worry not, child. It was his choices that led to his end, just as it was your choice to help us. Ah, so it was the boy's fault. If it were, you would also be culpable, Mask. But no, it's nobody's fault. How so? Nothing ever happens in a vacuum, child. No event can transpire without cause. No flame can rise without spark. I still don't understand. We Pyloon have a saying, Tapa a Mac. In your tongue, it would mean bloom as one. It's our way of acknowledging the unity of all beings, great and small. And so too does it apply to events and to happenings. Take, for instance, the flower. On its own, it cannot bloom. It cannot die. It cannot be at all. But with the aid of the soil, the flower can receive nutrients. And yet this soil is useless without death and decay to replenish it. With the aid of the sun, the flower can create food for itself. And yet without the flower, the sun is merely a heaving giant with nothing to nourish and warm alone in its empty void. If none of this were so, whose fault would it be? The sun? The flower? The soil? Would the idea of culpability even remain relevant? Were we not blessed with the fruit of consciousness, would the notion of fault even exist? And yet, here we are. Here, and blessed to be able to ponder these things whilst taking every one of these relationships for granted. Or if we had not given it a child, letter, would it be different? This is the root of what tape mac means. Feel no shame, child. There is no fault to be had. I suppose you're right. Thank you, Polani. You're welcome, child. Know that you shall always be welcome amongst the Pilati. You have honored us with your actions, and so too do we honor you. Tapa a mac. Tapa a mac. Polani. With kin, the way forward is made easier. What could be a mountain range becomes a hill, and what could be a hill becomes a meadow. The way ahead is dark. We need not face it alone, and I hope that we shall see each other again. Here we go. Oh, it is different. This is ending A. So if I had not given her interesting. Yeah, because it says I'm reading it its page here while it's going on. You'll be choosing paths, choosing sides, exploring, fighting, and solving puzzles. Uh you might also uncover some interesting facts about yourself in the process. Okay, yeah. I I feel I'm a bit I'm a different person now. Um It covers themes of self and the mind, but yeah, that's interesting that, that it plays that way. Anyway, we're gonna call it a day. Thanks for watching. So we're on each other. I'll put a link below if you want to check it out and uh, try for a different ending, I guess. Anyway, I'll see you next time.